As a landmark Toronto discount store, Honest Eds prepares to wind down business. There was a sale of sorts today. Hundreds lined up for a crack at some of Honest Eds' memorabilia. It was a chance for many shoppers to share their memories of the 66-year-old store and its iconic founder, Ed Mervish. Our Christina Stevens joined the fray. Hundreds lined up around the block at the iconic Honest Ed's bargain store in hopes of capturing a piece of history for themselves. About 2,000 hand-painted show cards spanning much of Honest Ed's 66-year run were up for grabs. And grab they did. We're renovating. Please excuse the appearance. That is perfect. Ian Price was first in line at 4.30 in the morning. Came down here as a kid with my mom. My mom has very, uh, very fond memories of the place. Edmonds of Blur Street, how fantastic is that? That's pretty magical. Thank you, Honest Eds. It's been a go-to place for a lot of new Canadians getting on their feet. My grandparents were immigrants and came to Toronto, so this was the first place they could uh, shop at. So uh, I remember coming here as a kid. In keeping with the true Honest Ed spirit, the signs are bargain price. Starting at just 50 cents each, 80% of them are under $8.00. And the most expensive right here at $100. And it was quickly snapped up by Carol Carr. I think it just epitomizes everything about Ed Mervish. He was famous for his birthday parties. It's the cake, it's him, the address is on there. I love it, my husband's going to kill me. <laughs> In high demand, signs from the annual Christmas turkey giveaway. The man gave away free turkeys to the city for so many years, looked after the people, and I thought this would be a great piece of history. Ed Mervish passed away in 2007, but left an indelible mark on the city with his store and theatres. He was always involved in the day-to-day, -day. his touch even on these signs. The prices had to be in red. The red's a good colour to be able to see the signs and see the... and my father liked fire engines. Over the years, Douglas Kerr has painted thousands of these. I like the, you know, the quirky ones and, you know, Honest Ed's is for the birds, cheap, cheap, cheap. It just kind of encapsulates the whole thing. The site has been sold to a Vancouver developer, and the store will be closed for good in 2016, but still doing good until the end. All money raised from the signs will go to charity. Christina Stevens, Global News, Toronto.